I want to listen to this first, then I pause the video, then I go and help them. Now, uh, to solve this question, right, uh, what you need to understand is, uh, this, there is a, there is an expansion here. There's an expansion here, meaning to say, uh, meaning to say, uh, I need to expand, I need to expand, I need to expand. But I got a problem. The problem is I have a power of six here. There's a power of six, there's no way I can expand. So I ask myself, what power is useful to me, so that later when I expand, uh, it makes sense. So I, I'm, I'm going to write down like that. Uh, one, uh, red means uh, it's working. Uh, it's not going to be marked. Uh. So I, I, example, uh, example, uh, I, I write that uh, this is A, uh, this is B. Uh. So maybe I use another alphabet. Uh, e plus Fx plus Gx squared plus Hx cubed plus Ix four plus all the way until x power six right agree or not if if i expand the power six all together yeah. i'll expand i'll have da, 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 until x power six right i have many many terms here right but my question is uh, do i need so many terms here i own hx cube i i don't know right? and uh uh four four five power four power five powers i got a lot of power but i my question is uh which power is useful Look at the final one. They only want bx square, right? So, just square. so actually, square will be enough, right? Square will be enough. So all this can be cancelled, right? I don't want already. Am I correct? I only want square, ma. Square is enough already. So what does it mean? It means, uh, I have to first expand. I have to first. I have to first. I have to first expand. Don't worry. Uh, I'll pause the screen here for you to take down. 2 plus ax power 6 into uh, something x square. Uh, let me put it number la, like e plus fx plus g. Let me erase and write again. e plus fx plus gx square. Only until square is enough, right? The rest all useless, right? Because after the expansion, I only want until square. So can you all try this question? Oh my god, what's wrong? So far I said I'll do Okay. So two plus AX to the power of six, huh? Let's try, huh? First one is two to the power. Why huh? only do two plus AX? Because one minus four X, nothing to expand. Huh? One minus four is one minus four X, right? Okay. So the two to the power of six. Then after that? Plus, right? Six choose one. Six choose one. Bracket two to the power of five, right? Then after that, um, ax. 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 You follow the binomial formula, ma. Binomial formula is then this one. N choose one, huh? That is because you refuse to look at the formula given to you. See ah, I I copy the formula. I copy the formula. I copy the formula a plus b power n uh, is equal to turn to that page i copy for you to see uh, a to the power of n right yeah I never bluff you uh, see two okay I, I copy the whole thing first okay let's start hey, let's continue now, uh, those who don't understand, uh, look here, uh, Vaish. Vaish. Okay. Now, see, a to the power of n means, a to the power of n means, uh, 2 to the power of 6, ma. see, 2 to the power of 6, I never bluff you. Uh. Now, second one, uh, n, n1 like that uh, means 6 choose 1, uh, so it's still the same. Uh. 2 to the power of 5 because first term, first term to the power of n minus 1. So, it was 6, ma. so n minus 1 is 5. Ma. Second one is AX. AX is power 1. Ma. So B to power 1. Ma. So it's like that. So still correct. But okay, Rachel, not yet. No, 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 no. The, the, this thing uh, is just generic like E and F and G. But there, there's, there, there's not going to be so many numbers and alphabets. Now, uh, Rachel, you're going to do the second one. 6 choose 1, done. So now 6 choose 2. Then this one becomes 2 to the power of 4. No, it's not still one. I want, I want. I want until square, ma. So, later, ah. Uh, so, can you, can you continue? 
2 to the power of 4, then followed by ax to the power of square. Now, do I still need the third one? No, I stop here already. I stop here already. I, I don't want any more. Because next one is cute already. This is your e, f, and g. Oh. Okay, so equal, uh, equal. 2 to the power of 6 is what? 1, 2, 8, is it? 64. 64 plus 6 choose 1 times 2 to the power of 5. Try. 6 choose 1 times. Hurry up. 6 choose 1, 78. Uh. Wrong. 6 choose 1 is 6. 6 choose 1 is 6, right? 6 times 32 is? 192. Hey, you don't oops uh. you need to you need to know why you get the number the, the yeah, strange yeah. number. I know six choose one times two to the power of five. Oh you didn't have to the power of five. I two to the power of two. So okay. one nine two eight. Yeah, yeah, why? Why? Because I type fast one, then I said it's fine. Now next one. Press six choose two times two to the power of four. What do you get again? Two four zero. Ah, okay, hang on. Two four zero. Now this becomes a square x square. Right, because ax coating square ma. so a square a square so now i'm ready to do the expansion right so now i'm ready so now i, I write again uh, from the first step i can come down already one minus four x bracket now i i change already i change to the expanded form is equals to 64 minus 160 x plus bx squared so far so good yeah okay so i i, I start again uh. so how do i compare how do i compare the coefficient or how do i do that so first i want to compare so i start compare what or i i just state down uh. i just state down uh what term do you want to find huh you can either state state down x to the power of zero x or x square uh, x coefficient of x x uh. The lousiest. You usually choose the smallest power or the highest power. X zero. But x x I I show you x power zero find nothing. See ah, uh. one times sixty four right is sixty four right. Is there other terms I multiply to get numbers? No. The other side sixty four ah uh, correct uh, they didn't bluff you uh. that means you are correct uh. So now you want to state state all the x one term. So where is it? Which term is it? 1 times what? X1 is just X1. 1 times 192, right? Because 1 times 192 AX is, one is, is X. Ma. 1 times 192 is... Ah, this is X term. I want only the X term. So this is 192 A, right? Is there one more? Oh, no. negative 4x times 64. Negative 4 times 64. I purposely just ignore the x. Ah. The other side, minus 160, right? Yeah, I pause the screen here. I try. Ah. X squared is what? Huh? Oh, 240. Huh? Do you understand 240 x squared? Why do you like a squared? Oh, because a is a number. Anything that is in front of x, I don't write. See, uh, I take 1 times this, right? Yeah. So, I take 1 times 240 a squared x squared. But a is a number. Le. Half. No. Uh, oh, a is half. Huh? Okay. But I don't know first. La, I, but a is a number. So, I must include. You see, if you don't include the a squared, uh, then the question becomes wrong already. 1 times 240. Where's your A? Got A man. There's an A here. Oh. Then A squared then. Then the A I just start in the half, right? Yeah, A, A little start in the half. X squared. X squared square no need, ma. X, because I, I'm comparing X squared already, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, so I don't want to write down X squared. So I, I, I circle. No. A got square what? Oh, you should. A, X square is A square, X square. Expand this. A X square is A X times A X. So this is a square x square. No, not yet, not done yet. So 
So 1 times 240, right? Yeah. Is that another term that multiply also get x square 1? The minus 4x and the 192, right? So I must take minus, then you must take 768a, right? Equals to minus 160. Eh, sorry, equals to b square, right? It equals to b, equals to b. Equals to b. B, no, no, no. B is just b, right? Now, I put in the a equals to half in order to find the... That's my water bottle. To find my water bottle. Okay, so to 